What's going on, AT? It's Jerry Smith, and we're going to be doing Hallow's Eve Clash. That works today because it's Monday and Halloween is tomorrow in the States, but tomorrow it's not going to make any sense. So, Hallow's Clash. That's what I'm going to call it. Uh, with this, let's go ahead and check out the deck. Jump into like and subscribe. It's a strong list, strongly suggested, but not uh, required. And in here, you can see that I am rocking my four heroes. So it's Bob, Bullock, Lois, and Steve. With that, you can see the combos they're making. It's all going to be one object. You got Dr. Bob, Goth Bullock, Masquerade Lois, and Boy Witch Steve. And then we got some leg variations of Bob and Lois in there. I actually think that Lois is going to be a bigger contender than I uh, expected. So I'm going to have her in there. And then, of course, I got uh, Steve too. So we'll see how it does. And yeah, go from there. But. I did choose three Loises and then four uh, of, sorry, four, four Lois, four Bob, with the Mythic included. All right, we're starting off level 20 because your AT League, I don't even know anymore, like sometime within the last month, you had to be above 2,250, and luckily I was, and I'm starting at level 20, which is the highest you can start in these. Um, I think as long as you get, by the end of this, battleground effect or the start of the next one or maybe even the end of the next one um up past 2250 you should be good to start at level 20 but uh, honestly with all the changes i'm very confused so take it with a grain of salt let's go all right so we get is that demolition 25 1,370 legs, 72 mythics going up first. Then we get Baba the Clown, uh, Bapo the Clown out first. I'm going to start off with Prop Stethoscope. It's uh, one that was very agreeable with all of my mythics. This one's going to leech, so we're going to leech. It was very agreeable with all the characters that I had, uh, so that's what I decided to utilize across the board. It had a lot of it. Also, it has that heal all component, high health, and I like that. Uh, so we're going to get another one out there. Could have done double Dr. Bob, but I decided not to. You know what? Just going to go ahead and take it slow. Looks like we get chicken fight. It's going to put definitely some damage out there, but it didn't do exactly what it wanted to do. We're going to take this thing with slot 1, 159 attack. That gas on Lois, that heal all, I think is going to be just brutal. Uh, no cripple all, you'll notice this combo. So it is going to be Steve, I think, has. No. Did I do nothing? Did I just put bulk out there with cripple? Huh. I'm missing something, obviously, in my ecosphere. Um, no. Yeah, let's just make the Steve combo. Get crazing, get leeching. And then, of course, if you hit it, you get it. That's what goes on with Payback, and that's doing a decent amount of work here. So let's um, get Masquerade Lois out. We'll do the PC version. It's going to get buffed up. I like it. Looks like we get $1 Joe in the mix, taking out slot one. Let's get Prof Stethoscope. Oh, wait, who are we going up against? It's uh, I have no clue what to say here. It's uh, Alba Pringe, maybe? 1,849 legs, 102 mythics. Did I lay attack? You know what? I think that's the other part with uh, with Lois, too. If there's a lot of cripple all going on, you're not going to land to that attack, so the gas actually has to land. But this thing's all said and done. Slot 1's going to take it. Take our hits, get Dr. Bob out there, and we will bring this one to a close. Moving on to the next. That should be level 22. Looks like it. Those coins are, when you win, will show the actual level that you're going to be entering, I believe. Yes, it is. Wait, yeah, it is entering. Okay, so Prop Stethoscope is going to be the first one. We, of course, are running into Ground Bone Glen because... <clears throat> There's just a little bit of that going around. I don't know if you've seen it, but uh, it's uh, it's out there in full force. All right, we get Bodybuilder Stan in slot three. That's definitely a concern. It's only going to get worse. That kind of sucks for me because 
it's getting really close to my prop stethoscope not too much where i'm actually going to be able to get like it's going to take me down but close enough where it's causing some issues um Hmm. 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 Okay. Was that smart? I don't think that was smart. That wasn't that smart. I just lost. All right, going down on slot three. Let's uh, it's what? Hernick. 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 I will say 1,523 legs, 94 mythics. I sh was looking at slot three and playing another card and just letting the slot two go down. I don't know. I, I would have to go back to see what was smart, but I definitely had a nagging voice telling me slot three was what I should have done, and now it's all but certain. So we're going up against Starland, jumping down a level here. This is going to be 1,799 legs, 97 mythics. Uh, Bullock, that's definitely a nice one to start off with, but we don't actually get an object, so I gotta go with the sure thing, get Dr. Bob out there. After that, I still don't have a sure thing, so let's go ahead and get Masquerade Lois. It's gonna be able to heal up my slot one, but I am worried about the damage that slot two can take, because you're gonna get that bomb, potentially the punch two. Um, maybe another Masquerade Lois is gonna be the, the play here. Because this thing's gas and that thing's that's gonna go. There you go. That's gone. Get another Masquerade Lois. 56 on the attack. That is just freaking beautiful over there, too. Taking it out, slot two. Starland down. Honestly, I feel like I have potential with this one, but I need to make sure I'm playing the right cards at the right time, and losing day one is not uh not a good omen for top 100 mentality, so. We're going to have to fight our way to a victory if that is going to work. Let's start off with prop stethoscope. The only thing I would have is, oh, let's go Bullock. Goth Bullock, get out there. That's the cripple that I have in the deck. So it's the only one I have if I need it. I don't have a lot of Bullock, so that's probably something else I should look into. Maybe even changing a PC or two. Um, maybe some one-man band to help with that motivate that we're going to get from Ground Balling Glen, as well as some Shield All. Uh, maybe would play a little bit better given the lack of cripple all in my deck at current state that payback is working you hit it you get it we're gonna get masquerade lois out sitting at 21 going up to 20 42 with the uh the buff so it's gonna be a devastating amount of attack even with a smaller pc even if it goes down to 13 like it just did we're still gonna have to bring some pain we're gonna do a lot of damage on slot two and slot one is going to be going away as soon as they hit it. You get it. That means we are potentially winning with slot one right here. Let's go ahead and make another Masquerade Lois and take the bin. Oh, wait. Alfonso, let's check you out, buddy. Alfonso M106. They are rocking 1,843 legs, 120 mythics. Going down on slot one. Thank you, Alfonso. Okay. Uh, Crimson Tiger. 1,559 legs, 113 mythics. Ground Ball and Glen out first, no shocker. Uh, let's just do Masquerade Lois because I feel like there might get some more motivate in here. Of course, it doesn't freaking happen, lucky me. Uh, let's go with Dr. Bob, and then we should actually make a real combo. But we waited the perfect time for Mythic Bob to show up. Hello, Mythic Bob. Very nice to see you. I felt like I was bordering. Not not in any way good, but bordering on a Mr. Fish Odor there. Mythic Bob. Yeah, that's that's. I don't know if that's actually in my wheelhouse. Um... Got some shit going on here. Let's get props stethoscope out. We're gonna open up our slot two, three. Um, that will at least bring us up to parity. If we don't make the combo, we do make the combo. Oh no, slot two is going down. Gas is probably gonna take out slot one right now. Oh, so close. All right, so we won't make the combo. We'll bring it up to parity. We get Dr. Bob, we'll use it. And this thing is gonna be taken down there, taken down there. 
Crimson Tiger down on three. Didn't even see that, actually. Was not looking for, for slot three to do what it did. So not a perfect score. Not going to have that top 100, but it's not devastating so much that it's not an opportunity. Something to keep watching on. Maybe some of that PC changes that I mentioned with uh, one-man ban, especially with what's out in play right now, because you're going to have a big opportunity, or you're going to have a big challenge with uh, ground balling Glenn being as potent as it is with the current battleground effect, which I'm not a fan of. Uh, let it be known. Three skills, not a huge fan of it. We'll talk about it another time. We'll talk about it later. But if you've made it this far in the video, I want you to know that I love you. I wish you the best of luck on your hits, and I appreciate you making it this far. If you want to return the favor and just do me a huge, huge one, uh, you could just listen to the toad. Peace.